Hey ladies, uh, it's my first official vlog um, for the Tone It Up series, um, Love Your Body series. Um, just wanted to check in with you and talk to you about basically how everything's been going for the past couple of days. Um, bear with me, uh, this is my first vlog, so this is, I'm getting used to the camera, so <laughs> it's kind of weird. For me. Everybody did a really, really good job on the first day. I mean, they're obviously doing a really good job now. But I just feel like the first day everybody was really gung ho and everybody really hit hit it hard and um, all these ladies are doing amazing. But um, yeah, so my first day was good. It was good. It was um, I was ready to go and um, you know the second day I was ready to go and the third day today um, I got on the treadmill to do ten miles and my legs just they just hurt. They were they knew I had gone full out the first two days. So my legs just hurt and I was tired. I did not wake up for a booty call this morning. I woke up for an afternoon <laughs> run. It was, I was tired because I made uh, it through the run and um, made it through the abs, which was really, really tough for me today. For some reason, I just wasn't feeling abs today. I was, it just wasn't. Yesterday and the day before that, you know, sure. But today, for some reason, I just laid down on the mat and was kind of like, okay, I can do this, I can get through it, I can do, you know, I did one, and then I was like, okay, all right, I did one, I can do two, I can do two. And then I got through two and I thought, okay, I could just pretend I did three, but no, I did three, and um, I felt good about it afterwards. I thought, you know, there are a lot of girls out there that I really admire and who are working really hard, and it would be a disservice for me to do that to other people and tell them I'm doing something that I'm not. And um, so I was really proud of getting for three. <laughs> Even though it was only seven minutes, it was still really, really <laughs> a long seven minutes. Um, so I'm really proud of everybody for getting through abs today if they did abs. Um, and also, as you may know, I've decided to go full vegetarian, uh, not vegan, but just vegetarian for um, the Love Your Body series. I, I want to see what it does for me. I'm. I know that some people are vegetarian for moral reasons and some of them are vegetarian for um, uh, health reasons and I mean there are plenty of other reasons. Um, I just, you know, I never really had given it thought um, until I started kind of following a couple of vegetarians and kind of seeing what they've been going through and listening to their stories and I thought, a plant-based diet, what's wrong with that? You know, what's wrong with giving it a try? Why not? You know? so. Um, I decided to go full vegetarian and um, I know my husband and my family think I'm crazy but I kind of feel like it would be a cool thing to, to see. I want to see what my what effects the protein from you know tofu or um, garbanzo beans have on me compared to eating chicken. Um, I want to see if it helps with weight loss or if it kind of keeps me on an even keel if I'm you know what what will it really do. Um, besides that, I feel like maybe going plant-based would maybe help with skin better or, you know, just having a better uh, complexion or um, just uh, going to the restroom. Do you go to the restroom more? Do you, uh, do you feel less bloated? I don't know. I guess I just kind of want to find out all these different questions that I have. Uh, I want answers to the questions that I have. So um, right now I have my... I have my tofu cooking or um, marinating, so we'll see how that goes. Everybody, when you say tofu, people, you know, non-vegetarians, I should say, kind of give it that look, and you're kind of like, oh, okay, so it must be kind of gross, but in my head, I'm trying to think, okay, do they even really know what tofu tastes like? Clearly, they don't know what tofu tastes like because they're non tofutarians <laughs> so um so i just kind of want to see what it tastes like and see i mean i've never cooked it so it was kind of weird to know that you had to press the water out of it and cut it up and there was tons and tons of different things you could do with it so i was kind of interested to see a lot see of what bonzo that. beans and a lot of raw or not raw excuse me uh, a lot of hard-boiled eggs lately like egg whites to try to supplement in for protein i've been doing a lot of uh, perfect fit protein um, to supplement um, for meat protein, so I'm just trying to make sure that I get enough protein to, you know, exchange out for what 
you know, chicken or beef would give me, which I kind of didn't eat beef very much here in the past couple of months. I just, my taste buds kind of grew away from it. They just didn't really, really care for it anymore. So, um, so I guess I'm okay with not eating beef, but, but I have been having extremely big cravings for chicken wings and we drove, my husband and I drove past the Buffalo Wild Wings the other day and I just looked at it and I almost started salivating. It was so terrible. I was like, I could really go for some hobbling or chicken right now. But then I thought, no, no, no. It's kind of like a sugar addiction. Maybe if you just stop eating it, you won't think about it. So, um, and then he had, my husband had mentioned to me that we were going to um, Chicago next week for a wedding and he th mentioned we were supposed to go to Dicka's, Mike Dicka's um, restaurant in Chicago and I mean they have by far the best burgers there, they have the best fries, oh my gosh just, their food's amazing and um, he had mentioned to me that I was not going to be able to eat their burgers so I was kind of sad about that because I know that they taste really really well but I'm thinking maybe I can find something like a veggie burger maybe and still be able to maybe sneak in the fries a little bit but um, so that was a little bit of a disappointment, but, um, it's just kind of weird because I wake up every day and I think, okay, I didn't, I didn't eat chicken last night. Okay. For breakfast, I'm not eating chicken. Like for some reason, I have a fear that I'm like hurting myself and eating chicken and not, I don't know. I, I, like I accidentally snuck chicken in my diet in the past couple days when I know I didn't. So I don't know. I've been having some weird irrational thoughts going on lately about chicken in general but I will stop um, ranting about chicken <laughs> um, but I just wanted to say that um, if you are watching this if you're one of the Tone It Up sisters thank you very much for watching it and and maybe give me some feedback on what you think about the vlog um, I'm gonna try to check in every other day every couple of days um, and just kind of write down ba basically what's been going on um, past couple days like I said earlier I've been doing you know I've been doing really good so I'm not to that stage where I'm so worn out yet that I need to take a break <laughs> because I know I will get there um, but I just want to say that all of you ladies out there are badass like you are doing such a great job and it's so inspiring to see so many women in this community just kicking ass and it's just it's just the coolest thing so um, I guess I will got talk to you guys later and um, I hope you guys are watching this. Love you guys.